That's such a like guy uh, like confidence booster to have to go after like 700 tall people um, and just like not uh, even be able to figure out that. You're <laughs> I admire you tall people. Uh, so uh, I guess like... We look down on you. Oh, it yeah. happens. It happens. <laughs> uh, uh, around nine years ago I was on a road trip and this guy that I was seeing sent me a text message and he was like, I wrote a poem about you. And I like, my ego blew up to like the size of Galactus. And then he sent me the poem, and it was about cockroaches and trash. Oh. <laughs> uh huh. Um, so, like a very non impulsive, mature person, I like fired off a poem to send back to him, like the weakest rap battle that's ever existed. <laughs> and uh, this is the poem <laughs> A Road Trip Through Colorado. Jason once emailed me a poem about garbage and how it's collected on his counter, filled with roaches. I read the poem bewildered on a road trip through a snow sea in Colorado, sick and praying to get sicker, with only traces of blood on my panties while puking in a gas station in Kansas the day before. Rhapsody of filth, am I the roaches I texted or the garbage? <laughs> Immobile silence, the snow lasted for days. I've known this queasiness before, resting tides of unease. No inspiration believes that she'll become the trash in an artist's work until she is kneeling westward with ice sculptures on the horizon, praying to get sicker. Thank you.